Hello, hello, and welcome back to my channel. I am Lisa of Diamonds and Stitches, and today I'm going to do a really quick unbagging. I purchased, I actually broke my nail by, uh, oh, I'm sorry, but I did this before I made the public announcement. Okay, maybe I did it after I made the second public announcement? I don't know. Anyway, um, if if you're on my my friend list of slap my hand no buy peeps that are you know trying to keep all of us in line, don't break your no buy because I did. I'm back to the no buy. Don't worry. Um, <laughs> anyways, um, I was cruising Etsy one day, and I came across this acrylic pen. And you guys know that I am a huge, huge, huge supporter of diamond pens on Facebook, the Facebook group, um, that holds sales, uh, three times a week, I think. And then they do, uh, the drawings or the winner winner, um, is by random name generator. And, um, and I will explain when I do a video, um, how that actually works, because I think that the new people are a little confused over how that the sales work. So anyway, I was cruising Etsy and I came across this pen and I fell in love. Like online, it looks beautiful. So we're going to see what it looks like in real life. Um, but it looked beautiful and I was like, ooh. And I know that some other people have bought from this seller before. It's Lee Grover on Etsy. And I will link all that information in my description below. But it's roughly the same price as um, the ones that I buy from Canada. Um, I just, you know, the exchange rate is better when you buy them from Canada. But um, yeah, so anyways, I just was like, well, you know, let's see. Let's see what the quality is. So let's uh, unbag it, do a little review, see what it's like, and I'll give you my impressions. And um, fingers crossed that it is... Um, what I'm hoping it will be. So let's get down here and have a look. Okay, so it came in record time, you guys. Like I, it, it actually came over the weekend when I wasn't here. I think it came on Saturday and I ordered it on Wednesday, Wednesday, I think. So Thursday, Friday, and then it was in my mailbox Friday, Saturday. So um, that's pretty good time. Like that's actually excellent time, right? So let's have a look see at what's in here so let me just double check yeah it's leaguerover.etsy.com and um and this one is called white aqua pearl and I just like uh, yeah when I first saw it online I was like Ooh, oh oh okay so this is a bit different than Diamond Pens. So Diamond Pens has, you know, several like 12 or 13 or 14 different styles of pen this, that they make. Um, this one, wow. Okay, wow. It's per day. So it's, um, it's kind of like a pearl white and then it's got some uh, pink on the tips. So on the ends, how pretty is that? Came with a single placer. And then came with a multi-placer. I believe that that's a three-placer. Um, yep, they can be removed, so that's great. Um, I will probably change these out. Um, this is super, super light. Like, yeah, super light. Is this? I'm pretty sure it's acrylic. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that it's a acrylic pen. Um the cool thing about this one is though is that okay so it's got um how do i explain it okay so it's got like this this um bump right and then it's a little teeny tiny taper right here for where your hand sits oh, so where your hand sits so that it's like um it's nice and it's a nice cushion like it it sits the the indent sits right nice on your finger and then where you um, place your other finger you know your writing writing finger um, it it just sits really nice in this little indent that's that's actually really nice and then um, 
this this little uh, middle, the middle, like the waist, um, and that's a very skinny little waist. That's a Barbie waist. Um, the old Barbie, not the new Barbies. Um, it has a band in it, like a like a little gold band in it. Um, but it doesn't sit exactly in the crook of your, your, um, you know, whatever this thing is called here, this little, this little curve in your, in your hand, it doesn't sit in there. So that's nice. So it's not like this, this sharp, um, difference in pen, you know, like the shape of the pen, this part, this part here sits right there and so it starts tapering into that bump again that little that little indent indent it's not a bump indent and then bumps out again to give it the shape to hold the placers so um wow this is i might use this um in my next video um yeah and test it out but this seems like a really nice pen. It feels really nice. It's got a nice sheen to it. Um, it's got some really cool, maybe, I don't know if you can see them. See, there's some pearlized, like more, where the color is more pearly than others. Um, that's a really, really beautiful pen. Um, and like I said, I paid $25 for it. And then there was tax and shipping. Um, and, uh, you know, the ones from Diamond Pens are also $25 um, on the sale ones uh, and um, $25 to $30 and then, or maybe that that's a customs, but $25 for the sale pens and then um, the auction pens, you know, are more. But um, yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a U.S. seller. So those of you in the U.S. that only want to, you know, have shipped from the U.S., um, this seems to be a good seller. Like it was fast shipping, reasonable price, really nice pen, um, feels nice. And so, you know, once I start using it, I'll give a better review on, on it, but Lee Grover. So it came with the pen and then, oh, huh, it came with some more stuff. I was so excited over the color of the pen. I didn't even look. Um, it came with some wax. A couple of squares of wax and then two more placers so is that a five placer and a nine placer guys i don't know um and came in this nice little bag and then it was uh wrapped up in plastic wrap so that's good and then came in a bubble in a bubble envelope so um yeah like good shipping fast shipping um was nice and you know like sent a sent a thank you right away good communication um, you know, so far, I mean, it seemed like a great seller. So, um, yeah, if, if you're looking for a U.S. seller and, um, you know, don't want to deal with, um, going through Canada and you're, a, you, you know, in the U.S. and you only want to have shipping in the U.S., again, this seems like a good seller. So, um, yeah, Lee Grover on Etsy. I'll link all that information down below. All right. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.